everyone, Miss Keisha, how's everybody doing? I hope everybody's doing fantastic. I don't know what I'm gonna title it just yet, but you might be able to see by the title. Because today is a very big day for me. <laughs> it's been seven long years of being natural and this is all I have to show for it, y'all. That's it. But I did cut my hair at the end of 2014, November 2014. November 2015 made a year since I cut my hair and now we're in May and this is all the growth. But yeah, today <laughs> I am going to get my hair relaxed. I'm gonna actually go ahead and get this head full of hair relaxed and cut and styled and I'm excited. Now for anybody who's wondering, it has nothing to do with hating my natural hair or not liking my natural hair. I will always love natural hair. Natural hair will always be my favorite style. But there's nothing wrong with switching it up. And I know a lot of people feel like relaxes are permanent. They're not, okay? Relaxes are not permanent because you can always grow your hair back out. That's how I feel. Hair is just hair. It will always grow back. I do not plan on being relaxed for like the rest of my life. I just plan on being relaxed for maybe the next year and a half, getting relaxers um, every three months. Because at this point, my hair is just a lot to maintain, being in school and having a lot of things going on. It's just a lot. And I've been wearing my hair literally in puffs weeks on end, and I don't like that. And then I found out that my flat twist, which is like my signature go-to style, has actually been breaking my hair. So I can't do flat twists anymore. So trying to find a new style that I can incorporate that looks good on my hair shape, has been mm. on top of that I've wanted to start over with my hair so this is like the perfect way to do that I'm really excited to finally relax my hair once again it's not gonna be forever it's just gonna be probably the duration of me being in grad school and then after I graduate then um, transition back to being natural because ultimately I still want my natural hair so yeah that's what's gonna happen today I'm gonna take you guys along with me the person doing it is my homegirl she is um, a certified hair stylist she went to school got her you know degree in that so um, I trust her um, and I've always trusted her to cut my hair she's the one who cut my natural hair she styled my hair plenty many times she's the only person who's ever colored my hair like I trust her with my hair so I'm going to her house and then I'm also getting it cut and um, styled for my birthday because I'm going to New York on Wednesday today's Monday and I'm going to New York on Wednesday so I'm super excited um so yeah I'm about to get ready to leave say goodbye to my natural hair y'all the last time y'all gonna be seeing it for a long time uh, hey guys okay so I'm I'm here now sitting in the chair don't mind my shirt I just asked her for a shirt because I was hot in my sweater this is the moment of truth guys this is the last time my hair is gonna be like this for a while so I'm excited and I'm just waiting for her to finish whatever she's doing so she can come and put the creamy crack on my natural uh, locks and I'll let you guys see it, you know, as we progress all the way through. But I'm excited, I can't wait. Sheer. How's everybody doing? <laughs> I hope everybody's doing fantastic. I am super giddy, as you can tell, because my hair, my hair, my hair, my hair. Okay, so you guys just finished watching some clips of me getting my hair done, me getting my hair relaxed, and this is the final 
final product so from that last clip I didn't get to show you guys my finished product from then but from that last clip I added a few tracks two tracks to be exact and I'll actually insert a clip of me with what my hair looks like that's actually a clip from my New York vlog um, which I'm in the process of editing so you guys will get to see that soon but that's basically what my hair looked like immediately after I got it done that same week I got it done that Monday that was Wednesday so that's what my hair was looking like yesterday was Monday it made three weeks since I've gotten my hair cut and relaxed it's reminiscent of me just straightening my hair honestly that's what it reminds me a lot of I was afraid that it was gonna be super like slick and greasy and <laughs> not able to move but no it, it just really reminds me of pressed relaxed hair I absolutely love it do I regret it absolutely not I do not regret it one bit to me it's one of the better decisions that I've made with my hair for the past couple months maybe even the past couple years. I think that it was something that I really did want to do. I'm glad that I did it because even though natural hair is my favorite hairstyle on me, a very, very close second is a bob. I love bob. So I was going from something that I love to something that I love, so it wasn't really a scary thing for me because I love bobs and I knew I was going to love my hair. The maintenance is really nothing compared to natural hair. The tracks that I had put in, they were actually glued because I had just gotten a relaxer so she didn't want to sew anything onto my hair because you know your hair is kind of in a, a fragile state right after the relaxer so she said to wait a few weeks before we actually sew the tracks down so I had them glued in just for my trip. By the end of the first week I had already taken them out. This past Friday I washed my hair. She came and she uh, sewed the tracks in and basically styled my hair for me. Now, one thing that I can say, one thing that I can say that has been a bit of a frustration for me is the fact that I have started working out. It has been very, very difficult to actually work out and keep my style. I tried something on Monday, yesterday, um, with my hair to see if that was gonna help, but it ended up really, really, really uh, wetting my hair regardless from the sweat. So I had to kind of run the flat iron on it today so that it could actually be presentable so that's kind of where I'm at right now trying to figure out what I can do with my hair when I work out so if you have any suggestions if you have short relaxed hair and you work out and you have a suggestion as to you know what you do to your hair when you work out please let me know leave a comment below so that I can figure out what to do with my hair when I work out I don't really care about my my edges because I mean that doesn't bother me but it's more so this part of my hair getting wet by sweat I has been a problem um, I will once again go natural in maybe two years I will transition slowly back but for right now I will keep this good relaxer I probably won't get another relaxer for another two months I want to stretch them out three months that's my goal and my hope but we'll see how that goes but yeah so that's everything if you have any questions about my hair or about why I did it or anything you can leave a comment down below and I will get to it as soon as I can I hope you guys love my hair as much as I do like oh gosh I love it I love it, I love it. let me do a quick spin around for you guys I don't know what the back is looking like so please don't, don't judge me if it's a hot mess y'all everything i will see you guys on the next video my camera's about to die i'm actually probably gonna film another video since i have time so i will see you guys on the next video and i'll talk to you guys soon love you guys